All right, we are on location tonight in my son's room. He's 11. He's got a gaming setup, and his father here bought him a while back a Pioneer VSX 9900S. Uh, late 80s, early 90s monster receiver. Um, lots of buttons, lots of, uh, of lights and such, and it works really well. And it has a fan on top, which I, I, I kind of mounted there and plugged in externally so it stays cool. Because these guys get hot, and it's already over 30 years old. For Christmas, he wanted an equalizer, so we got him a Rockville. I searched all over the internet and can't find a teardown video for the Rockville. This is the REQ52. This is like the second generation. Um, apparently, there's a first generation that's before this. It has the same model. This one's about three years old. But what's interesting is the equalizer doesn't actually, um, it, it, like, it doesn't like actuate to what you would expect. Um, this really is just more or less a, uh, a little graphical display that just keeps moving. And there's just not a lot to it. What I wanted to know is what's inside of here, because this is like a, I don't know, it's like a 20 or 22 band uh, EQ here. I want to see what's inside. I don't know if this is all discrete capacitors or all just chip based. So I'm going to go ahead and op open this up. But again, this is not a real spectrum analyzer. You can get this on Amazon for around $60. It does a good job and the, the bands are impactful, but uh, it's not, definitely not a, an equalizer you would see from the 1980s or 1990s. So let's go ahead and open this Six up. Six screws later. I mean, there's a lot of screws holding this together, including two on top here and two in the back and then two on each side. I am really interested to see what the heck is in here. Wow. Oh my gosh. There's not much in here. There's uh, audio input. It looks like a power supply. There's, well, there's an actual transformer, but there's like a regulator here. And it looks like everything here is on the board. And I see a chip here. This is probably for the equalizer, but it looks like there's probably capacitors or some sort of a tone circuit behind here. Um, I just was expecting a board with all sorts of capacitors, but there's not a lot in here. Again, this is the Rockville REQ42. It does pass audio really well. It has a lot of inputs and it's perfect for my son, but this is not a real spectrum analyzer because all it does is just have different modes and it just goes up and down like that. It doesn't actually go with the music. But each of the bands does have an impact, and he can adjust the EQ. So, anyways, I wasn't sure what to expect, but uh, no, there's not a lot in here. 